This class is nuts. Primero, I clear. Y le dice a Dan, shut it. Y después Dan le contesta, make me. Y entonces, en mexicano, Daniel interrupts the class y empieza a cantar. No sé tú, pero yo no. Pero al final de la clase, Maxine me dice, it's all connected. Mom, I got this. You ain't failing me out. Oh, I gotta go, I'm late. Bye, Mom. Ese mi hijo está loco. Okay, everyone. Today we are going over anatomy of the shoulder region. A very complex... I have a question. What is it, Dan? Can we skip to the foot? Nope, we're doing the shoulder. Well, that's perfect because I have a head start because I already know where the biceps is. Biceps, Claire. Gee, I can't wait to be at your medical school graduation. Dan, why is it so hard for you to just shut it and focus in class? Because I'm too busy making money. Oh, you're too busy making money? Well, go make your money and then leave and leave us the rest alone. Why are you at each other's throats all the time? I saw a TV show this weekend that said sometimes people who are constantly arguing actually have a physical and chemical attraction that they're suppressing. So, Maxine, what did you learn about the shoulder in your reading last night? Ooh, I'm sorry, I didn't do the reading. I was too busy watching that show last night. Ah, so you didn't do the reading. Did anyone else do the reading? Wait, where's Daniel? Oh, he passed his GED exam. What? But he could barely speak English. I guess he didn't need you, Dr. Dennis. Well, yeah, I guess he was just a closeted genius. So, now you can help us. So, continue, Dr. Dennis. Shoulders. I'm sorry. The train. Some crazy people. Well, you know how it is. Perdón? Tú eres latino? Y guapo. Me encanta esta clase de ciencias. Estoy lista. I'm ready to learn. Wait. Are you Mexican too? I'm sorry. Who are you? No, I'm not Mexican. What's, what's your name? Daniela. A sus órdenes, profesor, doctor, guapote. Okay, can we please get back to the shoulder? Seriously, can we just skip to the foot? The shoulder is a very complicated but amazing area. It's is that the shoulder? Yes. Perhaps you should take a drawing class or something. Yeah, maybe I should. Until then... Wait. Do you guys know who Janet Jackson is? Yes! Yes! Whatever, forever! Daniela, please. That's not Janet. Yeah, no, that's Shakira. I know, I know. Oh, 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 oh. No! Okay, so, so, so who is Janet Jackson? Janet Jackson is a singer who released the hit single Rhythm Nation in 1989, among many others. Perhaps you have my attention. Also, uh, Janet released one of my favorite albums, Velvet Rope. So, The Shoulder, what does this have to do with the most amazing singer of all time, Janet Jackson? Well, Janet Jackson's dancing was incredible. I'm sure you can all agree on that. What the heck was that? Don't worry, Claire. I take drawing lessons, you take dance classes. Deal. So the shoulder is a very mobile joint. The humerus bone is a long bone in your upper arm. It attaches to your shoulder blade called the scapula. This joint needs to be very mobile to avoid shoulder injuries, but also so that Janet Jackson and her dancers could kill it during their choreography. Maybe uh, Claire and you should take that dance class. Dr. Dennis, there is only two bones in the shoulder? Great question. The collarbone 
is the other bone that's part of your shoulder. The collarbone is also called the clavicle. Okay, cool. So, humerus, scapuloid, and collicle. No, Claire. Humerus. 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 Scapula. Scap scapula? Clavicula. Clavicle? Okay. Doesn't sound like the shoulder is that complicated. Three bones, got it. Let's go to the foot. How does Janet's foot work? There are many muscles that control the shoulder. A healthy shoulder is a shoulder that has balanced strength in each shoulder muscle, as well as equal flexibility in each shoulder muscle. Janet wouldn't be able to pull off her sweet dance moves. And she'd constantly be injured if each shoulder muscle wasn't strong and flexible. <laughs> Maxine? I'm sorry, I just googled muscles of the shoulder and the latissimissi dorsi muscle showed up. That's the latissimus dorsi is what you mean. A very large muscle, a very important muscle, especially for reaching up. It goes from your lower back to your shoulder, and if it is tight, there is no way Janet and her dancers could reach up. Is that what's wrong with me? Possibly, you might want to stretch. The shoulder is comprised of muscles that pull the shoulder backwards, such as the millitrapezius. Lift the shoulder up, like the upper trapezius and deltoids. Moves forward and pushes, like the pectoralis muscle. And pulls down, like the lower trapezius and the latissimus dorsi. Yeah, okay. Latissimus, doris, metroid, uh, pectorsals, Trapezoids, got it. Can we please just move on to the foot? Dan, latissimus dorsi. You can just call it lats, delts, trapezius, pectoralis. It's not that hard. Why are you even here? You interrupt all the time. What do you care? Last class, you barely wanted to be here. Now all you want to do is learn about the foot. Not like you want to be here any more than I do. Seriously, what's up with the foot? I sell sneakers. Yeah, we know. In math class, he's always talking about the number of sneakers he sells. Why do you care? Okay, well, maybe we both don't want to be here, but why not make the most of it? Okay, the floor is yours. I never graduated high school, is that enough? I have a business opportunity to make a deal with a big company. What kind of a company? A sneaker company that my grandfather started when he came here from Lebanon. And it got taken away from him. But whatever. The CEO won't do business with me unless I learn about the foot. We're developing a sneaker for the NBA. I can't go to college, so I'm here. So I would really appreciate it if you could just get to the foot. My grandfather is 95 and I'm not sure how long, how much longer he has. This deal would mean the world to him and my family. I like feet. What? I wouldn't mind if we skip to the foot in the next class. Maybe I'll even do the reading. Uh, I could get on board with that, but Dan, you better be on your bestest, best behavior. That's fine. I like speak too. Well, I guess if everyone's in agreement, we can go to the foot next class. Okay. Well, that's class. Thank you. Bye. I guess in the next class, you'll show us how the foot is connected to the shoulder somehow, right? Yeah, probably. You're still not a real doctor. 